if you want to know how to follow trends, if you want to know how to copy other people, or if you want to be an attention seeker, then this is not really the video for you. Hi everyone, it's Shantae. I'm back with another video. And today I want to talk about how to become the trend. Okay, so some of you may be aware on Instagram, I actually took a long break for like six weeks. And then I returned in November back to Instagram because I wanted to start my business. A tie by Shantae, if you didn't already know, check it out. I will link it down below. It's a jewellery accessory line um, infused with intention and yeah, I just love it. For the last two months that I've been back on Instagram, uh, I've been trending. I've been a trending business. And what this basically means is that your profile gets a lot of visits compared to other profiles with similar following numbers we're trending for some reason so i wanted to make a video and discuss with you how to become the the trend how to become the trend if you want to know how to follow trends if you want to know how to copy other people or if you want to be an attention seeker then this is not really the video for you so yeah if you want to be a leader and a trend setter, then yeah, this is the video for you. Okay, so here are my tips on how to become the trend. Number one, I would say is don't copy other people. Um, a lot of the time we can see what others are doing and think, I want what they have. So I need to do what they are doing, I need to be the way they are, I need to copy what they're doing um, to have what they have. But that's not true. At the end of it, at the end of the day, you always have to be you. Okay, so you can try and copy somebody else, but it's not going to work the same and it's not going to feel authentic because you are not being yourself you're trying to be somebody else so tip number one is stop copying other people we need new we need new we need different we need new energy if you like something obviously you can use that be inspired obviously we're going to be inspired by other people um, but stop trying to be anyone else but you. The only thing you can be is you, okay? <laughs> tip number two is to be authentic, which kind of flows from tip number one because when you are authentic, you're just being yourself, you're doing what you wanna do, and you're doing everything your way. So when you stop copying other people, then you start just doing things how you wanna do them it starts to work out because we all have our own journey to go through um, so trying to do what someone else is doing is not necessarily going to work out the same you have to do it the way that you are meant to do it uh, and that leads me on to another point number three which is inner work do your inner work okay i know this is a video about trending and you didn't expect me to say something about spirituality when we are talking about trending on social media but i will say every single thing is linked everything so if you work on your energy then the results will show on the outside so doing your inner work is a huge step to achieving anything you want 
Um, I have been doing years of inner work. And what is inner work? Inner work is shadow work, meditation, journaling. You could even add therapy into there if you like, if that's what you want to try. The uncomfortable inner stuff. Whatever you've been avoiding, it's going to show up sooner or later. If you're avoiding something, it's going to show up. So the best thing to do is to face it, deal with it and let it go and move on. Because then your whole life will improve for the better. Energy is the foundation of everything. Okay? It's the foundation. If the foundation is not on point, there's no point trying to fix the outside because the inside is not on point. Keep your inside in check. Stay in alignment. Focus. Yes, so if you're just trying to use social media to fill a void, uh, you feel like you're missing something in your life, then it's not going to work. It's just going to make that feeling worse, okay? You have to come from a place of, um, my life is great, my life's amazing, and I'm only just sharing a little piece of that with the world. If you're not genuinely happy with your life, you can fake it on social media, but it's gonna be, it's gonna be kind of obvious. Like, it's gonna be like, huh, you are not actually about that life. You are just pretending. Pretending doesn't work. Don't bother pretending. We don't do pretending, okay? We don't do pretending. This brings me on to the next tip. I think this is number four, which is, mind your business <laughs> um it's so easy to be caught up in what every single other person is doing especially on social media we all want to compare their lives to our lives but you just have to mind your business okay doesn't matter it does not matter what everyone else is doing you have to focus your energy back on you because every time you are wasting your energy on every single other person there that's less energy for you okay so if you want to be the focus of your life you have to take the energy that you're putting on everyone else and bring it back to you and and how can I be better how can I be better how can I level up how can I improve my life focus on you don't focus on every single other person stop gossiping mind your business why do you want to do this why just stay focused on why what you're here for what you want to create what you want to bring into the world that's what's important okay not what everyone else is doing what you want to bring to this planet just put that energy back on you. Number five, keep them guessing. Keep them guessing. What does that mean? Keep them guessing means don't be so predictable. Stop doing the same things all the time, every day, on repeat. Like stop, stop doing the same thing all the time. If you keep doing the same thing all the time, you are gonna have the same results. That's it. So keep them guessing, switch it up. Keep switching things up because every time you're switching things up, you're changing, you're growing, you're evolving. If you stay doing the same thing all the time, you will not change, grow, evolve. You will just stay there, okay? Keep them guessing, be unpredictable, do things out of your comfort zone, post things out of your comfort zone, say things out of your comfort zone, wear things out of your comfort zone, be outside of the comfort zone. Keep going outside of it, keep going. People love mystery, people love having glimpses and not actually knowing a lot about somebody, but like kind of filling in the gaps. I think that's what keeps uh, something trend, somebody trending is like 
not giving too much away. And number six, or the final tip, is to stay private. Uh, this is a difficult one because we're talking about social media and obviously you want to be authentic, you want to share authentic, authentic things about yourself, you want to be honest, you want to be trustworthy, you want to be yourself, but you do not need to tell everyone everything. Don't. Don't. You don't need to share all your business, your bank balance, friend problems, your boyfriend problems keep it to yourself keep those things to yourself like if it's not gonna educate and enhance someone's life there's no need to talk about it okay certain things just do not need to be said to strangers on the internet it's just like it's just common sense really that's it really you don't have to show everyone everything about you that's it that is it um i think that's it if there's any other videos you want to see please do let me know and yeah thanks for watching guys uh check out attire by shantae this is a vintage piece that i made a vintage brooch um yeah um i will be working on new designs constantly and i'll be updating my website with new items thank you for watching i hope to have many 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 more useful videos in 2023 and yeah uh take care bye favorite youtuber back